Praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. This is the day the Lord has made. We would rejoice and be glad in it. Welcome to Morning Glow. Welcome to another time in the presence of the Lord. It's a beautiful, awesome day. It's a day to declare His glory, His power, His awesomeness. Father, we magnify you, we celebrate you, we rejoice. You are our God, you are our Father, you are our Savior. You are everything to us. We thank you for your salvation. Thank you for saving us. Thank you for the power of the living Christ in our life. Thank you for shedding your blood to redeem us from destruction. Thank you for writing our names in the book of life. And thank you for finding us and saving us and delivering us. Thank you for this morning, the opportunity to be in your presence. Bless someone today. Let this August morning, grace upon grace, favor upon favor, flow from this place to your people. Let healings be done and deliverance be done to the glory of your name. Thank you, Jesus' name. Amen, 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 amen. We'd like to welcome all who are joining us today. We trust the Lord that you will be blessed. You'll be favored. Your life will never be the same. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. And so we welcome you from the rising of the sun to the going down of it. From the east and the west, from the north and the south. Welcome to Morning Glow today. May you be blessed. May your morning be beautiful. May your day be awesome. Please take the time to... Invite your friends to join us on Morning Glow. Let them know it's the place of power, it's the place of strength, it's the place where you receive inspiration, where you receive direction, where a prophetic word is spoken into your life to set the course of your life towards victory, testimony, healing, breakthrough. Share, 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 share with somebody. Praise the Lord. Amen. Let us know where you're joining from this morning so we can speak into your life, pray for you. Durban, South Africa, Sao Bona, St. Paul's, Bristol, blessed and highly favored. San Ramon, California, God bless you. Cordoba, in Spain, Dio Steven Diga, blessings on you today. Ebo Shayede, Middleton, Cork, blessings. Braintree, blessings. Uh, Otako Abuja, Nigeria. God bless you. Hackney, London. Blessings on, on favor on you today. Tanosh Kienebe O Kambare Ondele Bredus Ondele Ba Kandere Rosa Yekaba Queenstown, South Africa. The Lord bless you today. Clapton, London. Blessings. Portsmouth. The Lord bless you richly. Wellingborough. In the Midlands, be blessed and highly favored. Malo Shkaedo Merero Ketalara, Millennium City in Ghana, blessing. Domen still or something like that in Pabi. Diofu Benis, Kidbrook in London, blessings. Lusaka, Zambia, blessings. Harlow in Essex, be blessed and highly favored. Walton Cross in Western London, West London towards the airport. God bless you. Douala, Cameroon, Jehovah Benis. Lome, Togo, Jehovah Benis. Sacramento, California, the Lord bless you this morning. Along the hill in Quebec, Jehovah Benis, Canada. Warwickshire, blessings. Stanwell and Staines, the Lord bless you. Monrovia, Liberia. May you be blessed, may you be favored, may you be lifted in Jesus' name. Kampala, Uganda, blessings. Red Bridge in Essex, be blessed, be favored. Odonkor in Ghana, the Lord bless you this morning. Aiko, be blessed, be blessed, be blessed, be blessed, be blessed. Cumbria Close in Coventry, the Lord bless you today. Harangay in North London. May you be highly favored. May you be blessed of the Lord. Kushayena ba kusota liriba. Lika le kuzobrana tandele bukataya. May you know the victory of Jesus, the blessings of the Lord. May the hand of the Lord be upon your life. For victory, for testimony, for the awesome God to show mightily in your life. 
Tatsani Maseru Lesotho. The kingdom of Lesotho is inside South Africa. It's a kingdom on its own. The Lord bless you this morning. Fulham, blessings. Camberwell, blessings. Oyo, Nigeria, blessings. Baltimore, Maryland, USA, be favored today. Sacramento, California, be favored today. Magboro, Nigeria, the Lord bless you richly. Praise the Lord for everyone from the four corners of the earth. You've joined us today. May you have testimony. May you have victory. May the hand of the Lord touch you for good, for grace, for favor, for testimony, for blessings beyond measure, for the goodness of God to be manifest. You will not regret. Rather, you will celebrate today. Pass the new and take a back. Kundoshia dedi. Runa bikio untombra kes kalabrosh kaya dedaba. Testimony will meet with you today to the glory of your name. In the name of Jesus. Katie, Texas, blessings. Danbury, Connecticut, blessings. Kwashebu, Ghana, blessings on you this morning. Eton in France, Dieu vous bénisse. Cardiff in Wales, blessings of the Lord on you this morning. Uh, Queens Dravi Koyi, Nigeria, blessings, 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 blessings on you today. Atlanta, Georgia, blessings, Ashford in Surrey, be blessed, Nile Favored. Oh, you know, Shindelere, Kuntelere, Hauteng in South Africa. Saubo Nakunjani. God bless you this morning. Uh, Cousin Road in Chatham. Blessings. Ali Kota. Teto Runazia. Yero Kata Lerebo Kota. Subbiton. Blessings. Turkey. Be blessed in favor this morning. Need and veil. Blessings of God on you. Bloomington, Indiana. Arai. Lamini. Ah. Saubo Nakunjani. God bless you, that Dlamini name. It's a royal name that connects Swaziland and South Africa and uh, I think uh, Namibia. Blessings on you. Long Island, New York. Blessings. Favor on you today. Chicago, Illinois. May you be highly favored at all times. In the name of Jesus, Kayenosha, Renosi Ababa, Epelegos, Nigeria, the Lord bless you, Amsterdam, blessings, blessings, blessing, Nazing in Essex. May you be highly favored today. Halifax, West Yorkshire, be blessed and highly favored. We would like to welcome, celebrate Bangalore in India. God bless you richly, Congo, Kinshasa. The Lord bless you this morning in the name of Jesus. I'm laughing because one of my cousins, that was his nickname. He loved to be called Congo Kinshasa. I don't know why. This morning, the Lord will bless you. The heavens will open upon you. Favor upon favor, grace upon grace. In the mighty name of Jesus, you will have testimony. Medoshia, Mekebirio, Idabranosa, Kearebo, Sotayari. As he tears wiped off your eyes, the enemy had planned for you to weep, 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 cry, 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 cry. But get ready. The testimony of Jesus will be awesome in your life. Get ready for testimony of Jesus Christ. And so, Father, we rebuke the atmosphere of death around somebody. We rebuke the spirit of death. 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 We declare and decree you will live long. And no news of evil or death will worry you, trouble you. Rather, in the middle of whatever you shall be strengthened, you shall not bow to adversity or challenges. You go from grace to grace, from favor to favor, from blessing to blessing, from testimony to testimony, from the glory, from glory to glory, from honor to honor in Jesus' name. I'd like to welcome everyone this morning. 
Yale boko tora ma keke torosha. The scripture teaches us, and I mean, we started praying yesterday, that God will arise for you. Let God arise, let his enemies be scattered. In the book of Psalms, Psalm 68, verses 1 to 8, <clears throat> say, let God arise, let his enemies be scattered. Let them also that hate him flee before him. As smoke is driven away, so drive them away. As wax melted before the fire, so let the wicked perish at the presence of God. But let the righteous be glad. Let them rejoice before God. Yea, let them exceedingly rejoice. Sing unto God. Sing praises to his name. Extol him that rideth upon the heavens by his name, Jah. And rejoice before him. A father of the fatherless and the judge of the widows is God in his holy habitation. God setteth the solitary in families. He bringeth out those which are bound with chains, but the rebellious dwell in a dry land. O God, when thou wentest forth before thy people, when thou didst march through the wilderness, the earth shook. The heavens also dropped at the presence of God. Even Sinai itself was moved at the presence of God, the God of Israel. So this morning, you need to know that, yes, God said, I will rise. When God arises for you, no one can stop him. Praise God. Oh, my, yeah, yeah. That word, let God arise, is a powerful word. You know, sometimes uh, we have said to ourselves, let me try. Let me do it. Let me have it. Let me see it. Let me go. Let me drive. Let me. But it's amazing when those same words come together and it is God speaking. And it says, let me rise for you. Something will happen. So that's why when the Bible says, let God. So it's no longer me. Me doing it. Me rising. Me doing this. But God rising for me. God stretching his hand for me. God proving himself. Oh, Abisha. And you know it's as if he's asking permission, let God arise. It's as if he's saying, do you mean, need me to come in? You've got to make way for me. When we allow the Lord in our space and we give room for him and we get out of the driving seat, worry will no longer be your portion. Trouble of mind will no longer be your portion. The things that used to worry you will be the reason you will magnify the Lord. <clears throat> let God arise. So he's waiting on you to admit that you need him. We need him. He's waiting on you to call on his name, to cry out to him. Let God arise. He's waiting on you to believe that he can make a difference. Even where it looks like, how will this happen? How will God do it? Where will the door open from? Where will the answer come from? Where will the breakthrough come from? But the God whom we serve. The Bible says, let God arise. What can stop him? In fact, when God arises on your matter, he can use the smallest of mad things to fight your fight, to win your battle, to set things through, to bring about your testimony, to shut the mouth of devils, to give you absolute victory. Let God arise. He's waiting on you to invite him. That's why I say, let God, just let him Ah, this morning we are letting God. And as we let God, you will not be put to shame. As we let God, he will walk on your behalf. As you let God, there will be testimonies to follow you. As you let God, there will be healing upon healing. As you let God, there will be testimony upon testimony. As you let God, the battle which is not yours, which is his, he will fight it to, until the enemy knows that, ah, they have taught the wrong person. Kape Oshka Pendre Roromasha Rika Petosona Pelita Nikababrano Ronama Let God God will fight for somebody on the platform this morning. Let God Hallelujah Eka for all those attacks on your life, let God Ikabakakaya for all those attacks on your finances, let God for all those attacks on your health. 
let God. For all those attack on your family, let God. For all those attack on your business, let God. Why? Because <laughs> before the problem arose, he had set the answer in place. Kairosha. The Bible says he, 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 he conquered principalities, then he made a public show of them. He made a show of them openly. God will disgrace Satan for you. Riba, Ramosh, Kaba, Prados, Nebere. His, Satan is waiting to embarrass you, to shame you, to make you bow your head. He's been making suggestions in your head, like we said on Sunday night. When it comes to use your mind as a stronghold to lie, ah, but let God, let God arise, 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 let his enemies be scattered, let God arise. Long before the demons of fear attacked your mind, God already have made fear his enemy and he knows he was going to attack you. So he said, he didn't give you the spirit of fear. You are conquering, you are overcoming. Long before the devil ever went after you as a child of God, he had been thrown out of heaven. Revelation chapter 12, verse 7 to 11. Long before poverty stretched its ugly, nasty, terrible fingers, bony fingers, hungry fingers to touch your life. God already made poverty his enemy. He said, I will supply all your need according to my riches. Ay, 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 Higher, let God arise. Long before depression and anxiety and worry and stress ever touched your life, the God of peace, Philippians 4, 7, the God of peace, Isaiah 26, verse 3, said, let me leave that worry to me. Leave the depression, anxiety, and trouble of mind to me. I will conquer for you. I will give you victory. Ah, God will arise for somebody this morning. Let God arise. Let his enemies be scattered. The Holy Spirit is on standby to make a disgraceful show of everything that has touched your life. Let God arise. God hates the things that are hurting you. Let God arise. It hurts God to let God arise. Ah, he kaba, he torada, he kotora, he koyadaba, he koyadaba, he radadadada, he radadadada, he radadadada. God is rising from his temple, not from the middle of the street. God is rising on your behalf, and it can come from any angle. He will shock the enemy, he will shock the devil, he will shock even you by the victory he gives you. Father, this morning we magnify you, we celebrate you, we thank you. You've risen in the past, you've risen for our health, you've risen for our joy, you've risen for our deliverance, you've risen for our victory. Well, thank you, thank you, Jesus. We thank you, 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 we bless you, we thank you, we bless you, we thank you, we bless you, we thank you. We thank you for all that you have done in the past. We thank you for all that you have said in the past. We thank you for the hand you have stretched in the past. We thank you. We give you glory this morning. Thank you for victory. Who will not serve a God like this? Awesome God. Glorious God. Powerful God. God who heals. God who delivers. God who saves. God who sets free. God who blesses. Take the glory. Take the honor. Take adoration. Take praise. Take the glory. Take the honor. Take adoration. Take the praise in the name of Jesus. This morning, by the oil of God upon my life and by the presence of Jesus Christ upon this holy platform called the morning glow, I declare and decree this morning, God arises for every disease, every sickness. The sickness dies. The cancer dies. They say, 
Father, I lay hand on that girl. There's a young lady. I had to pray for her on Sunday. She has a cancer that hits one in a million. It hits people six and above. The girl isn't even probably more than 40. The devil is a liar. You foul spirit. You spirit, you cancerous spirit of hell. You spirit of the abyss. You demonic entity from hell. We bring the blood of Jesus. We bring the blood of Jesus. We bring the blood of Jesus against every cancerous cell. In the name of Jesus, we command healing. We command he, he himself took cancer. You've been taken by the Lord. It does not belong to that girl. Inaka, Kopiniki, Taliniti, Tarinota, Ibareno, Tarinipo, Abarito, Barikito, Bareneto, Shanenepa, Bareneto, Ikambra, Ikumbre, Itumbra, Telushka, Parote, Ekia, Amato, Embreto, Sambreka, Total Health, Total Healing, Total Health, Total Healing, Total Health, Total Healing, Total Health. In the name of Jesus, from this morning, sickness dies, disease dies, fear melts away. In the name of Jesus, we we'll lay hand on that young lady one more time. We command total healing. Everyone on the platform who have been diagnosed for one thing or the other, genetic, psychosomatic, uh, from viruses, from bacteria, from parasites, wherever it came from, he himself took as i pray this morning let healing virtue flow on morning glow 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 tari di taro da pero no kere ba paro do teri ga bara do zinibi from this morning Total health and healing. Total health and healing from this morning. Total health and healing. In the name of Jesus, we command healing. We command health. We break the grip of sickness. Ah, there is power in the name of Jesus. We release healing virtue today. We speak into the life of that young lady. Come out of the bed of languishing. Come out of sickness. Come out of disease. Ah, let the miracles begin. Let the miracle begin. Let the miracle begin. Let the miracle begin. Let the testimony begin. Haya, hayo, umbra, hika, tejo, paki, toza, rane, tora, peka, toja, tika, rika, tozo, renika, kaka. Let them see the finger of God in this young lady's life. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, to you be glory. To you be glory this morning. 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 Let God arise for every kind of ill health that have attacked somebody on the platform. We declare total healing. We declare total healing. We declare total healing. We declare total healing. We declare total healing in the name of Jesus. Ah, upon this altar this morning I declare diseases die in the presence of the Lord. Fear melts in the presence of the Lord. Diseases die in the presence of the Lord. Fear melts in the presence of the Lord. Disease dies in the presence of the Lord. Fear melts in the presence of the Lord. Kaba, Toka, Meka, Roka, Teka, Pata, Rota, Pero, Teri, Kapo, Zoli, Mate, Cambre, Tombre, Nombre, Taleke, Habrodosha. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, glory. 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 E kapara toto tari kadaba. I release the hand of the Lord on somebody this morning. Let God arise. Let God arise. I lay hand on that family. 
who have felt a lot of frustration and attack on their life, I command total victory. Every spirit of frustration, every confusion, frustration, confusion, frustration, confusion, I break you free from it. I speak your destiny into manifestation in the name of Jesus. You've come to Morning Glow today. Today will be a day of testimony for somebody. Paradosa, every arrow targeted at you and your family. Let God arise. Every lie attacking your mind. What Satan said he would do with you, I'll kill you, I'll eat you up, I'll destroy you. The devil is a liar. John chapter 8, verse 44. Every lie that has been spoken by hell against your health, we, blood, we wash it out with the blood of Jesus. Every lie that has been spoken by hell against your financial breakthrough we wash it out by the blood of jesus every lie that has been spoken by hell against your progress we wash it out by the blood of jesus victory in your house victory in your house testimony in your house victory in your house testimony in your house victory in your house thank you lord jesus Oh, thank you, Jesus. Naba ke toro kazadeba. Nali di di di. Habari di da. Let God arise. Let God arise. Let God arise. From this morning, let God arise. In a powerful way, let God arise. Hiraba ka hiraba. Hika. When God arises. <laughs> when God arises. <laughs> as great as the kingdom of Egypt was. God used the simplest things to fight Pharaoh. <laughs> Lies, frogs, turn water to blood. They are minor weapons in the armor of God. Ah, darkness. He just withdrew the sun for a few days, pushed the sun away, and put something to cover the sun. Ah, <laughs> ah, ah. And that is the Old Testament. We are under a better covenant. A covenant sealed by the blood of the Son of God. So this morning, on your behalf, God arises. God arises. God arises for your victory. Hebra, Hebra, Hishka, Hebra. Let God arise. 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 Every stronghold militating against you, their power is broken. Their grip is broken. Every stronghold holding your family, holding your children, that will not let them go. From today, we release your sons, we release your daughters, we release your children. We break them from the grip of darkness. We break them from the grip of hell. We break them from the grip of darkness. We break them from the grip of hell. Let God arise. Let God arise. Every spirit of Balaam hired to curse you. Sangoma, witch doctor, clairvoyants, warlocks, white witches, black witches, whatever their name is, who have been hired to curse you using esoteric means. They are Balaams of today. Wherever they are, <laughs> they took Balaam to, lie to the right strategic point from where he can see the children of Israel to curse. He didn't know whom God blesses. No man can curse. Let God arise. Anyone, anywhere who have set traps for you, who have put together any machination, party, not only imagination, but machinations against you, fire burns them. Fire burns them. Fire, 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 fire. Fire burns them. Victory is yours. Testimony is yours. Nashtika barodozai. 
neshko pare talikazi akata rosho kabara every balam spirit intended for your destruction intended for your distraction intended for your <laughs> for prolongation of battle let god arise from this morning god fights your fight god wins your battle 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 in the name of jesus one more time i pick on those balaams there's somebody they may have put together some things against you and please, when we pray, when we speak prophetic words, hold on to them. Don't try again to stop me on, on a Sunday and some witches are after me. The power from this platform is bigger than any witch. Who is the witch? If God be for us, who can be against us? For I am persuaded that neither heights, nor depths, nor angels, nor principalities. Ah, Kairo nor Shire. They hired Balaam. Put him in a five-star hotel, so to say. Gave him the best ride. Paid him the highest price. I said, just curse these people. Out of jealousy. They are the people only passing through the land of Moab. Give us water. You say you won't give us. Give us food. You say you won't give us. Just be rest because we rested on the outskirts of your land. You are hungry. Some people have not seen you yet. Glory is coming to your house. Favor is coming to your house. Blessings coming to your house. They can't handle your present manifestation. What will they do in the fullness of your glory? Let God arise. 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 Every Sangoma spirit, every witchcraft, every warlock, every 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 harbor, demonic harbalist, anything put together, concoctions, phylacteries, speeches, they made something, they dropped. We nullify with the blood of the Lamb. We release the fire of God. Against it in the name of Jesus. Ayekotoshaya, he koraba kozotaya, he taliroro kazolaba, he kotoro raba kataeda, he kosotoro tedede dadada, he raba kotora. Every Egyptian pharaoh shall be frustrated for your sake. Let God arise. Pharaoh looked and thought, these people are nothing. You know, whenever slaves are taken, the people who enslave do not see the people as humans. They see them as property. Roman enslavement, Nero will, will tie Christians to trees and burn Christians to create light for his parties with, in his orgies with all the women he will bring to his parties. And Christians are the light to the humans, the things to burn. That is a spirit. Same, uh, it's the same in all of those places where they took slaves. It's the same in Car uh, in slavery is taken to the Caribbean islands or to the Americas. People were not treated as humans. The boss can come, rape, do what he likes. It's not a crime. It's interesting. People are flogged for the smallest, for the smallest accusation. You are done. You are finished. Or if I, just for your color. <laughs> The worst film I ever watched is 12 years a slave. You almost get so angry you want to enter into the TV to go and fight the people. Can't you see these guys are educated black? But listen, this morning, he that the sun sets free. Free indeed! Every weapon, every attack, every demonic entity, every Egyptian spirit, every pharaoh that have come against you, let God arise. Let God arise. Let God arise. Let God arise. You are the son of God. You are a child of the living God. This morning, by the power of the living Christ, God fights for you. God wins your battle. God fights for you. God wins your battle. God fights for you. God wins your battle. Wins your battle. Arrows of the kingdom of darkness targeted at you. They return to the sender in the name of Jesus. 
they return to the sender in the name of Jesus. Let every power, let every power that come against you shall fail in Jesus' name. Act, declare, and decree. The Bible makes us understand that the Lord rises upon the upon the upon upon the wings as eagles. Ah! May the power of God rise like wings of eagle. Fall, fall, fall upon you, me upon you. May the power of God rise like wings of with, with wings of eagle fall upon you. May you move in power, move in strength, move in glory, move in grace. Let God arise. Put down everything that have come against you in the name of Jesus. This morning I declare and decree, let God arise. Let God arise. Every evil <laughs> notation in an evil book that this is the woman who is our target. This is the man who is our target. We withdraw your name. The name of Jesus. We withdraw your name. We withdraw your family from every evil book. We withdraw it from the book of death this year. Ah, not you. Not you. Not you. We will draw your name from the book of death. As in the name Ezekiel, wherever you are, whoever that person is, I declare you will not die, you will live. You to declare the glory of God. I see the name Yetunde. I prophesied this morning you will not die, you would live to declare the glory of God in the name of Jesus. Uh, there's somebody, I don't know how your name is. I see a ban in your name. Ban. I don't know, it's ban fool or ban whatever. You will live! And everyone around you will live. Abarosha will cast the spirit of death, will rebuke the spirit of death. We curse the spirit of death. We rebuke the spirit of I don't know why I feel this urgency against the spirit of death. I don't know why. Karibo, Terika, Parano, Hirabado, Hirika Baba Baba Baba, Hikiri Nebaroshkenia, Ebaroski Talaraba, Ebarano, everyone within the reach of my voice this morning. You are covered by the blood. You are covered by your blood. You are covered by the blood of Jesus. 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 Your family is covered. Your children are covered. Your grandchildren are covered. Your great grandchildren are covered. Everything that connects to you. Covered by the blood of Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Lord, for the victory. We wash our mind. We declare no evil. 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 The ladder of the enemy is broken into pieces. In the name of Jesus. The weapon of the enemy is broken into pieces in the name of Jesus. The spirit of adversity and affliction is canceled in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. The angels of God to go and execute justice on your behalf in the name of Jesus. Against evil forces, against those de demonic fingers, those unclean fingers, that want to see you as someone to be destroyed. We stop their hand by the blood of the Lamb. Let God arise. 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 Let his enemies be scattered. Let God arise. Let his enemies be scattered. Let God arise. Let his enemies be scattered. This morning God arises for you. He gives you the victory. He wins the battle. Now let God arise for your blessing. Dreams, visions will come to pass. Dreams and visions will come to pass. Dreams and visions will come to pass. Let God arise for your finances. Let the money come from the east. Let the money come from the west. Let the money come from the south. Let your dream become reality. Let your vision come to pass. Dreams becomes reality visions become reality let the money come from the east let the money come from the west let the money come from the south in the name of jesus in the holy name of jesus
from today's supernatural breakthrough. Supernatural breakthrough becomes your portion, becomes your story, becomes your portion, becomes your story, becomes your portion. Supernatural breakthrough becomes your portion. Let God arise. Money is belonging to you. Caged somewhere. We break the cage. We release your finance. We release your property. We release your money. We release your blessing. We release your glory. We release your testimony. We release your joy. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Every satanic hindrance to what belongs to you, clear by fire, clear by fire, clear by fire. Every satanic doors, gates, hindrances are against what belongs to you, clear by fire, 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 clear by fire. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, glory. Oh, glory. Oh, glory. Oh, glory. Oh, glory. Oh, glory. Let the story change from this morning. Let testimony follow you from this morning. And as God rises, you shall rise. From this morning, second phase of our prayer is that you are going to rise everything that is opposing your rising shall itself fall everyone that is opposed to your rising shall themselves fall shall themselves fall when your god rises you are rising when your god rises you are rising Hallelujah! and the bible says and they said let us rise and build you will rise and build. You will rise and prosper. You will rise and increase. You will rise and be favored. You will rise and be blessed. You will rise and build. You will rise and be favored. You will rise and increase. At the kappa, at the kappa, at the... you will not go and beg where you are when you where you are going to bless. You will never go back and beg. Where you are, you shall never beg. You will not bow your knees at the place of disfavor. You shall not become a mendicant, a beggar. You will never bow your knees to evil. Rather, blessing follows you. Everyone opposes, opposes, opposed to your rising. They fall themselves. Nehemiah 2, verse 10. But when Sambalad from Horon and Tobiah the Ammonite officials heard about what had happened, they became very angry. Because they didn't want anyone to help the people of Israel. My God, can you be a hater of good? But there are. There are those who don't like the good news they hear about you. It offends them. They dance. They dance. They dance. Even in the body of Christ. They rejoice. But anyone who have rejoiced at the throw of stone of evil at you shall also hear your good news. They will not die yet until there is a rising. You shall rise, 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 you shall rise in the name of Jesus. Nehemiah 2 19 when Sambalat, Tobiah, and an Arab named Geshem heard what we were planning to do, they laughed at us and said, What do you think you're doing? Are you going to rebel against the emperor? You know, because some people cannot handle your rising. You're breaking out of the mold. You're becoming the woman of destiny. Your children excelling. They do not know how to celebrate. This morning, wherever you are, let your amen be like fire. Send the link to somebody to join us in this part of the prayer. Eh, say, everywhere you are, you are rising. So say amen right now. Every force or forces that are not happy for your blessing. They fall for your sake. Every falls, every force, all the forces that are waiting for your destruction, they shall be exposed in the name of Jesus. 
every power that is actively pursuing your downfall, they shall come down. God will bring them down. God will bring them down. God will bring them down. And by the authority that he gave us, we bring them down in the name of Jesus. We bring them down in the name of Jesus. We bring them down in the name of Jesus. We bring them down in the name of Jesus. The mouth that is boasting that you will not rise and build and succeed. Sambalat, Tobias, Geshem, they'd gone around to the settlers who were just coming back. God scattered Israel, in case you don't know the picture. He scattered them because of sin. Now they had come back. Nehemiah came to rearrange them and reorganize the place. Sambalat, Tobias, and Geshem were controlling the place. They are the ones selling water. You need land. They are the, land. They are the <laughs> native land sellers. Native water sellers. You need wood. They are the sellers. And Nehemiah came to free people. They were offended. Everyone who's taking advantage of your pain. Fire burns them. God fights them. Whoever is hiding and stealing from you. Fire burns them. 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 God fights your fight. God wins your battle. 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 Every effort that is being made for your own effort to fail. They shall fail in Jesus' name. They are making effort. They are working so hard, maligning and using everything they can to attack your destiny. <laughs> you cannot suppress cream. Cream has to rise. Pour the milk in the glass, the cream will come to the top. Pour the cream milk anywhere, the cream in it will come to the top. You are the cream of God. You shall rise, you shall rise, you shall rise, you shall rise. Your children will rise, your family will rise, your dream will rise. Haini Taka, Aparo Zombia, Italy. Hey, you have to be very careful in your house. I see somebody uh, in the morning glow. You see, have your towels tied around you, walking around the house. Okay, no worries. I'll stop there. So I just bring blessings on your life. Everything that have troubled your mind, we speak peace from today. Ah, I see a revelation. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, my God. I don't know who this is. You prepare something so nice. This is a terrible revelation. You prepare something so I did it also. You prepare something so nice. Somebody went to the toilet and carried the waste and put on this nice job you have done. So that it shall be it should be rejected and people should turn their back on you. Every waste shall be wasted. Every waste shall be wasted. Every waste shall be wasted. Anyone who is taking the waste, the evil, and putting in your good, God fights them. God fights them. God fights them. God fights them. God fight. They will carry the evil they package themselves. Psalm 7, verse 15 and 16. They will carry the evil they package. 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 Harita, Harita, Harora. <laughs> oh my god this god is too much i now see a massive hand that came out in one swipe it swiped all their rubbish and it was as if nothing happened not even a dot that is your testimony as the lord lives there shall be a rising there shall be thanksgiving when these things happen make sure you give god all the glory they brought waste the hand of the Lord have wiped it away. It goes back to their camp. The glory of the Lord shall rise in your house. All eyes shall see it. For the mouth of the Lord of hosts have spoken it. The beauty of the Lord shall be upon your life. The glory of Jesus shall be upon your life. Every dung. I, I mean, so I can see it very clearly. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. They went and poured it there. <laughs> hey. mm. But in one hand... An angel of the Lord came and swiped it to their side. 
I don't even know why the swiping was like leftward. It was like leftward. I don't know why that was, <laughs> but whatever that means prophetically, he swept into their camp. Uh, it shall be as if you never went through anything. For the Lord will fight your fight, and the Lord will win your battle, and the Lord will give you testimony. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Every effort being made for you to fail, fails in the name of Jesus. Every complacency, every agreement, every conspiracy, every conspiracy of persons, one person or persons that wants to set you back, it goes back to their camp in the name of Jesus. Let your amen be powerful this morning. Anything that is on standing your way, saying I shall hinder her from growing, I shall hinder her from being blessed, we send it to the camp, to their camp. Every eye, physical, spiritual, looking at your plans and dreams, hoping to slow you down, we shut their eyes, we shut their life, we shut their eyes, we shut their life, we shut their eyes. Every Sambalat, every Tobiah, every Geshem, wherever they are, who are profiting from hurting you ah they shall profit no more their nonsense shall be exposed their lives shall be exposed you shall have victory 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 in the name of jesus anyone who is opposed to you being helped it offended them that some people have come to look that Nehemiah had come to, to look for the welfare of Israel. Nehemiah was a prime minister. The Bible calls him cup bearer, but what it means is the man closest to the king. They were offended that he left all that glory to come to this dust and become bricklayer, carpenter at the same time, head of the army, just because he wanted Israel built. And somebody is offended by your sacrifice. We, we carry coals of fire. We pour on them. We carry coals of fire. We pour on them. We carry coals of fire. We pour on them. Anyone, anywhere waiting for evil report concerning you. Next time they hear of you, shall be promotion. It shall be lifting. It shall be blessing. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, every blockade standing between your helpers and you, we destroy by fire. Anything trying to block your help, anything trying to block your blessing, we destroy by fire. 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 In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, every distraction that raises his head against your destiny, man, laws, situation, rise above them in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. From this day you will rise. Nehemiah 2.18, And I told them of the hand of my God that had been upon me for good, and also of the words that the king has spoken to me, and, and they said, let us rise and build. I lay hand on you this morning. You will build. You will build your dream. You will build your future. You will build your destiny. You will build your property. You will build your vision in the name of Jesus. As God rises, you will rise. 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 There is a rising coming to your house. No matter how bad it has been, receive zeal. Receive power. Receive confidence to become blessed. Receive zeal. Receive power. Receive confidence to become blessed. The Lord will help you. The Lord will strengthen you. The Lord will help you. The Lord will strengthen you. The Lord will help you. The Lord will strengthen you. The Lord will help you. The Lord will strengthen you. Thank you, Jesus. He said, he says, <laughs> and also I spoke, I told them the words that the king had spoken to me. 
the words that the king had spoken to me every negative that evil people have spoken to you that is attacking your mind every negative that somebody have spoken that is affecting your spirit i can't so bad the blood 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 and the king and i told him the word that the king had spoken to me May every word that was spoken into your life become reality. Every word that was spoken to your life shall lift you up. You are coming out of weakness. You are coming out of doubts. You are coming out of embarrassment. You shall be encouraged. You shall be strengthened. You shall rise and build. You shall rise and possess. Say amen wherever you are. You shall rise and build. You shall rise and possess the land. You shall rise and take te territories. You shall be encouraged. You will not be discouraged. Power will rest upon you. Favor will rest upon you. Agents of discouragement working against your desire will bow to your God. They shall be far from you. The joy of the Lord will be your strength. Laughter will be your strength. Peace will be your strength. Glory will be your strength. Haya, Paco, Tuza, Hikarabo, Hikabara, Hirozoba. I close this morning with Nehemiah 2.20. Then I replied to them, the God of heaven will make us prosper. That's you. And we, his servants, will rise and build. That's you. You are rising as the Lord rises. But you, Sambala, Tobias, you have no portion or right or claim in Jerusalem. From this morning, may the God of heaven prosper you. May the God of heaven open doors for you. May the God of heaven. Ah! Ikapado, ikake, kakakro, not made by hand, not powerless powers. May the God of heaven prosper your hand. May the God of heaven lift you in everything that pertains to your life, irreversibly, irreversibly blessed, irreversibly healed, irreversibly delivered, irreversibly on top, irreversibly joyful. Katata, ikete, iproto, kapaka, raya! Thank you, Jesus. Victory in your house. May the God of heaven raise you above failure, raise you above stagnation, Permanently, no more stagnation, no more stagnation. Things begin to move, no more stagnation. Things begin to move, no more stagnation. Things begin to move. May the God of heaven, ah, hey, use the full, use the extent of his power to sustain you. I was going to say, may God use his full power to sustain you. It will be too much. He's omnipotent. The one he hasn't used is omni. That's the meaning of omnipotent. The power that is his still potential that he has not used is too much. By the power of the Lord you shall be sustained. Favor is coming. Unsolicited help. The help you did not ask for is coming. In the name of Jesus. <laughs> In Nehemiah 2 verse 3. He said, I answered, your majesty, I hope you live forever. I feel sad because the city where my ancestors are buried is in ruins and its gates have been burned down. Then the king said, what do you need? This morning, men and women who will ask you what do you need shall connect with you. Help us will rise. Bless us will rise. They will make your dream happen. Not blood suckers, not users, not opportunists. Help us will be sent to you. Your head will be lifted. Your mouth will be filled with joy. You will celebrate the goodness of God in the land of the living. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 Stay with us for powerful confession before we close this morning. A couple of announcements were just a couple of days for the great international gathering of champions. This year's one promises to be just outstanding. It's a combine of voices that are like Old wine and new wine. We're going to be having Pastor Deepo Liomi, uh, Tudor Bismarck, Mensah Otterbill, 
Festus Adie, uh, Samuel Pata, Keon Henderson, Ivan Castano, Toby Ashimalo, get ready. Heavens will open, blessings will be great. We'll also have messages in between, 10, 10, 15 minutes from our seasoned ministers in house. Get ready to worship also and to celebrate during the gathering of champions. You see, the cost of registration is no more than the cost of a good meal in today's world. It isn't that you are paying for this conference. You can't pay for it. It costs so much more. It is just for you to just keep a token to register. And register you should. Take the days off work for those of you who live in the United Kingdom. Don't keep telling yourself, oh, I can endure, oh, I can be doing it from home. Yeah, there's payment for remote connection, but how about you really being on ground and converging with the people of God and connecting with the people of God and convening with the people of God? Come, praise the Lord. So scan the QR code that will take you into all details. During this conference, there will be winning conversations, questions you can ask. But you can only enjoy it because it is daytime. If you are not there, you won't even hear your own question being answered. Finance seminars will hold. We're having HSBC on ground, one of the biggest banks in the world. This will be priority entry for those who are IGOC registrants. It's holding at 4 p.m. So you need to take advantage. It's going to be a full day every day. There's also a wellness section. They'll be testing people for cholesterol, blood sugar. They'll, tell, they'll talk to women on their health and men on their health. Many people have just fallen suddenly and died and we have wondered, oh, is it a demon? And many people just do not realize the problem. Uh, there will be measurements for height, weight, and abdominal circumference. Jesus is Lord. Holy Jesus, man. So you better go do some work on your stomach and get something down. Praise the Lord. It's going to be great. You know, people don't know that these things matter. Do you know that it's out there that if for a man, his waist is more than 42 inches, he's writing a letter to diabetes. And for a woman, if her waist is more than 35, 36 inches, she's written a letter to diabetes. Not your portion, I know, but you got to do something, bro. <laughs> Order your T-shirts for IGOC. Beautifully designed by our own in-house people. What a beauty. So make sure you take advantage. On Tuesday, which is next week, Tuesday, in preparation for IGOC, We'll be doing a prayer walk around the premises. Hey, that will be something else. So that's the day before IGOC. If you arrived on time, take a bus. Catch up with us. Come with us. We're anointing the whole grounds. We're walking on all the ground. Every time you drive into prayer city, you know you're on holy ground. But hey, it cannot be too holy. We want to release the power of God. This is a very unique one we're doing. Amen. IGOC also has a time for your children. So there is a children's version of Rise. Hey, I almost seem to prefer their logo, man. I love this logo. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very smart. Very smart. So IGOC for the children will be awesome. We also have for the teenagers. Make sure you join us. It's going to be absolutely great. Praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. I'd like to just also encourage you, we're getting ready. On the 17th of this month, we'll start our countdown of 100 days to the crusade in Nigeria. Christ's compassion to the rural world is taking on the city that used to be the largest city in West Africa. The city that right now has a population of 4 million people. We're taking on the city that has been the crossroad of the ancient and modern. We're taking on the city that used to be the land of the first, first this, first that, in the country of Nigeria. We're taking on a city where 
Warriors have risen from this city to go and conquer. People have risen from this place. Also, all kinds of atrocities have been done. Slaves have been held. Uh, people are, we are breaking the power of the enemy. We are bringing the power in the name of Jesus. We're bringing the power in the blood of the Lamb. We're bringing the power of the Lord to the land. It's going to be a mega crusade for salvation. We're looking forward, trusting the Lord. In a place like this, 4 million people, 11 local governments, we're trusting God for 20,000 souls to give their life to Christ. Holding at the Liberty Stadium. The first stadium, can you believe this, in Africa? Yeah, first massive mega stadium. This city has a lot of firsts. It's also the first city to ever have a television station. Actually, before France. Can you believe that? Yeah. We've seen souls saved, but also there will be compassion. Souls, souls, souls will be blessed with food and all kinds of things. We're going to carry out 400 surgeries. We're going to do 30,000 children being dewormed. You may not even realize how simple water, the dewarming, is so necessary. Many children have died cheaply. Children of destiny and greatness. We can't do this on ourselves, on our own. God gave me this initiative to hold a compassion crusade in a nation like Nigeria, largest African country. One in eight black person you meet on earth is a Nigerian. By the year 2050, the nation will be somewhere around 300 million people. 22,000, I mean about 20,000 babies are born every day in Nigeria. Crazy, crazy, crazy. You don't quickly reach these souls for Christ. Hey, it's a nation sitting on gunpowder. We need to show the love of Christ. So our hashtag is Ibadan. This is love. Ibadan. This is love. Hashtag Ibadan. This is love. First John chapter 4 verse. I can't remember the verse now. I say, and this is love. First John chapter 4. Ibadan. This is love. Let's go touch the city. We need you. Can you believe that your seed, if you give a seed of a thousand dollars, that I don't even know how many things it would do. Let me just try to calculate. It might just put the one one kilo of rice in the hand of a blah 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 blah. A, we, you might just put it in the hand of so many people. I think two hundred people, something like that. I don't even know. We need you. We, we, the last two days of the crusade will be medical. It's still daunting in my head. I don't know how we're going to get 150 to 200 doctors to line up. I don't know how we're going to get 200 uh, pharmacists. We'll try. We will try. And uh, medicine that will be required will be somewhere between 250 to 300 million Nigerian currency. I hope that is enough. We want to really, really impact. Please continue to pray. We don't want stampede. We don't want danger. We don't want anyone losing their lives because when the needy see abundance, sometimes they, something in them tells them they will not get their own portion. And so they stampede. Pray for wisdom. But above all, pray for the salvation of souls, salvation of lost souls. Ibadan, this is love. Ibad and this is love. It's a city also that has a serious Islamic stronghold. We're just coming to preach Jesus and show his love. Nothing in this world that can stand against the weapon of love. Hey, love is so powerful. Ibad and this is hashtag Ibad and this is love. Hashtag Ibad and this is love. Oh, Yamakata Kazaka. We're taking on this stadium that is almost 70 years old. The, the stadium we are seeing is just one third of the facility. The ground is so huge. And God is blessing us. We'll be holding the surgery on the ground. One of the halls there will be probably properly equipped. We're holding the pastor's conference there. We're expecting 10,000 pastors. Man, pray for me. I'm ready to give over 10,000 of my books and uh, over two or 3,000 of my Bibles. We're believing God for unusual, unusual move of God, man. Ibadan, this is love. So, also, please share the details. Create your own uh, 
information, send it out to friends. If I know this is love, uh, this mega crusade healings will be done. You can take all those details of our things we'll be giving. The, the medical day is the last two days, Friday, Saturday. Uh, we did one day medically Kurudu. We obviously observed that it was too small. I have tried <laughs> all that I had. I poured in. I've already bought rice enough for 75,000 people. I've paid for beans for 75,000 people. Paid for the stadium. We've already also just hired, rented another warehouse in this town. We cannot be logistically carrying equipment and all these goods from the city of Lagos to Ibadan every day. We want to, from now, begin to store things in the warehouse we rented in the city. Everyone just, they don't care. They just want to take advantage, but let's just show love. Even the people renting the stadium, renting this, you have to pay for it. But Ibadan, this is love. Ibadan, this is love. I believe God for great things to happen. Salvation of souls. Like I said, ironically, God has sent me to two cities that are very funny. Ikorudu, where I really suffered in hunger while I trained in seminary. Ibadan, where I lived with a woman who gave us poisonous food for three to six months. And we only survived by grace. Rotten food, man, rotten food. I ate rotten food for <laughs> three to six months. Ah, oh, Jesus, man. You know, I, I wish sometimes uh, we'll, just, we'll just see a dream of how the future will be. Even if you saw it, you won't believe. I think when I was in seminary 40, uh, 50 years ago, I saw these crusades. But they just looked like, how can it be? Then I remember Miles Monroe. One day standing in IG, say, I hope we can find the video. He said, Pastor Madhu, I see you filling the stadiums of, of Africa. And I'm thinking, Jesus, man, I just want to be a pastor. I, I we must look for that Miles Monroe prophetic word. He said, I see you filling the, the stadiums of Africa. And also my friend, the late uh, Harry Jackson, comes to speak for us exactly 30 years ago, 2000, 1994, in Danley Road. And it just busted into prophetic word about uh, the things I'll be doing in Africa. And I'm thinking, hey, I'm in London, man. I don't want to go to know Africa. But here we is. Here we are. Praise the Lord. We're going to close this morning. I know we've taken a very long time to explain this vision. Please pray for the vision. Please support the vision. I want to say thank you to many of you who made Iba uh, Ikurudu happen. Yeah, a large chunk was whatever I could put, but oh, we bless the love of each one of you. This one, we need you. We need you. It's so huge. It's so daunting. Uh, met met about 3,000 pastors the first time. I will be meeting another 500 younger generation pastors on Thursday this week. Uh, you know, the Gen X's of that area. I just felt to meet them separately. So they can go bring all the Gen X's and all the Gen Z's to the meeting. Praise the Lord. Then we shall have another pastor's meeting which might attract three to 4,000. Every time we meet those pastors, we have to feed them. We have to take care of them. And then the final summit on Crusade. The reason we are holding pastor's conference or on Crusade is to not only win souls, but to empower the pastors who will take care of them teach them how to run things, how to do things, how to do ministry, how to, how to believe God, and for them to just see that one simple guy from their midst. I've learned to do whatever God <laughs> is giving him to do. Hey, it's amazing to find that we left Ikorodu with excess. This Ibana can't see us live with excess, man. Man, I cannot see us live with excess because Ivan is the meeting point of many cities. I think people are going to come from, hey, Jesus help us. Because the first pastor's meeting, heads of pastors from about four other states showed up. And I'm thinking, man, I just want to do this state, this town. Pray for us. Just pray for us. I'm excited on one hand. 
Mm. And I'm scared on another hand that Jesus, man, is daunting, but he's able. He's able. Mm. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Uh, the World Master Class is going to be holding on Saturday. This Saturday, the fifth is interesting. Uh, fifth leg of the road to riches. We'll just close on that fifth, even though we can't finish the material. It was so elaborate and big, uh, but it's very powerful. You need to learn to open yourself to be blessed of God, to be taught of God, to handle prosperity. You see, God wants to bless you. God wants you to bless your generation. And God wants you to be able to make an impact in the world for him. I close this morning by declaring and decreeing into your life that you were created for prosperity, not poverty. That's your portion. You were created not for just enough, but more than enough. That's your portion. I prophesy unto your life today, you are not a slave to Egypt's financial system. That's your portion. I declare and decree today that you are created to walk in God's overflow of blessing. Receive in the name of Jesus. I declare today you are created for wealth. You will walk in wealth. I prophesy unto your life today, the shackles of Egypt have fallen off your feet. I declare and decree to your lives today that God's financial principles go with you. God has given you the power to get wealth, the power to prosper. As you seek his kingdom, you will not fail. Things will be added to you. Money will come to you. You will prosper. In the name of Jesus, you will go out with joy. You will be led forth with peace. The mountains, the hills will break forth with singing before you this day. Ah, the Lord will rise and fight your battle, and you also will rise and possess your possession. So shall it be in the name of Jesus. Amen, 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 amen. Tomorrow, do not forget, we are together and we are going to get blessed. Tomorrow in the morning, glow, and tomorrow in the evening, Bible study. I'm thinking, I'm praying on launching a fresh new subject from Wednesday, even if we only did it this Wednesday, and we waited till after IGOC to continue, that's great. I just want you to start to salivate. What is the subject? What is the subject? Well, tomorrow morning, we'll first enjoy, uh, enjoy morning glow, then we'll give you the subject, uh, and then it will prepare you to really, really walk the walk of faith. The Lord bless and keep you, make his face shine upon you in Jesus' name. The Lord bless you. Dio se bendiga. Dio se bensoe. Buwana aku bariki. Onyamishra. Ye barikish. Ye barike. Mwariva kukombrere. Ewo muzita. Rayesu. I declare and decree into your life today that blessings follow you. Nothing will stop you from being above only and never under. Winning and never losing. On top and never under in the name of Jesus of Nazareth. Praise the Lord. Thank you very much for joining us this morning. Thank you. And like they say, I just came from Kigali. So in Kigali, when they say thank you, they say Murakose. Murakose, good morning. Uh -huh.